Good, you made it. I've been receiving reports about the savior of the NCR for a while now and wanted to meet you myself. You've proven yourself especially capable. And right now, I can use all the capable people I can get. Crocker gets handed the fluff missions that no one else wants to do. When people need something really important done, they come to me. Usually I dispatch one or more rangers to see these things through, but I'm a little short-handed at the moment. Think you're up for a real mission? Since the majority of my men are on assignment dealing with the Legion, I need someone to handle other matters that have arisen. Make no mistake, there's a battle coming, and I intend to make sure there are no loose ends when the time comes. One such loose end is a gang known as the Great Khans. Have you heard of them? They're a rowdy bunch, and pride themselves as warriors. The dark leather and horned helmets they wear are pretty distinctive. The NCR has a rather sordid history with them, and I'm concerned that we'll find them aiding our enemies when the Legion attack comes. That is, unless we get to them first. I want you to visit them in their canyons to the far west and make sure they're in no shape to join the Legion. They're just another gang of raiders as far as I'm concerned, so deal with them appropriately. Any questions? Don't fool yourself. I've dealt with enough of these gangs to know that they can't be trusted. Is there anything else? Then you'll need to make sure none of them are left to do so. Any other questions? I can't lend you any troops, but I've already sent word to Quartermaster Barden that you're to be given full access to our hardware. You'll have to pay for what you take, however. We can't afford to give away equipment. Did you have any other questions? Good. I look forward to hearing of your progress. Dismissed. Hello? I haven't seen a follower around here in years. I haven't seen you before. What brings you to the Great Cons? That's a complicated question. They've done horrible things to our people to be sure, and I've gladly killed many of their soldiers in battle. But I can't bring myself to hate them the way Papa does. Things would damn sure be better for us if they were in charge than Caesar. I suppose if asked, I would. But that's a moot point, because Papa's in charge now. And he's not going anywhere. Name's Regis. I'm Papa Khan's advisor and right-hand man. I'm also the chief enforcer of the tribe's laws, so watch your behavior. Papa is one of the best leaders the Khans have ever had. He's kept us together through all of our hardships, ever since we left California. Bitter Springs changed him, though. He started to really hate the NCR after the massacre. And sometimes, I worry that's poisoned his mind. Nothing. Forget about it. I shouldn't be talking about this with an outsider. Until next time. Why'd you come here?
Nelson's back in our hands. Hope we can defend it this time. Yes. Did you have an update on the cons? An alliance? That's an interesting proposition. Any plan where I can throw packs of raiders at the enemy instead of my own soldiers is a good one. We don't have time for diplomacy. This battle is coming any time now. If the leader won't be budged, he'll have to be replaced. I want you to go back to Red Rock Canyon and assassinate this Papa Khan. You'll have to be stealthy. If they see you do it, they'll kill you. Here, take this lockpicking gear. Your best bet is to wait until late at night, find a back door, or catch him by surprise when he's alone. Good luck, soldier. Dismissed. Things are getting stranger every day. Though you aren't of the Legion, you've aided us more than once. We acquire many items on our raids, some useless to us, some forbidden. I've provided you the location of a drop box where you can obtain these items. The box will be replenished every few days. Please be aware that we'll assume any items left in the box will be unwanted and be removed and destroyed. Stay an ally of the Legion and we will share our loot with you. If you start working against us or become an enemy, our deal ends. True to Kaiser.
are you holding up? What do you want? Why'd you come here? Something else you wanted? Without Papa Khan's guidance, I don't know what else to do. All right, you can tell the NCR the Great Khans will fight for them when Caesar attacks. Until next time.
Yes. Did you have an update on the cons? Excellent. You've done very well indeed. These tribals will make useful machete fodder. And if it should turn out we need their land later, well, it's not like we don't have the force to drive them out again. In the meantime, however, I have something else I want you to look into. We've had some disturbing reports recently concerning the Omertas, one of the three families that run the Strip. Our intelligence has discovered that high-ranking members of the Omertas have been having clandestine meetings for the past several months. We haven't been able to determine whom they've been meeting with, but if it's Caesar's men, we'll need to act. I need you to uncover what they're up to and stop it if it threatens the NCR. Any questions? Excellent. You'd think living in the lap of luxury and power would be enough for some people, but no. But we have other problems. While investigating the Omertas, what little I could on my end, I came across something much more sinister. Evidence suggests that Mr. House is planning to make some kind of move when the battle breaks out, and I'm guessing he won't be coming to our rescue. While we don't know what his exact plans are, my orders are to take no risks. I'm sending you to take Mr. House out of the equation. Any questions? To name a few things off the top of my head, expand his borders, get the NCR and Legion to wipe each other out, and seize Hoover Dam. Any other questions? We've had reported sightings of Mr. House's Securitron spying on both NCR and Legion forces. Also, given a recent analysis of the sightings, we now estimate that Mr. House has at least four times as many Securitrons as previously assumed. He wouldn't show his hand like that if he weren't prepared to move. And neither the NCR or Legion can spare the troops to investigate. Which is why I'm sending you. Any other questions? Perhaps, but that's not my problem. Vegas is a nice place for the men to go on vacation, but it'd be an acceptable loss next to the dam. Good. Then you have your orders. See that Mr. House does not present a problem. Dismissed. Nelson's back in our hands, but we can defend it this time.
Why have you done this? Centuries of preparation. So much good undone. Enjoy your time in Vegas. Lead the way.
smart move for the kings to back down. They didn't know who they were messing with. Report. Is Mr. Howe still a threat? But he's still alive? I'll have to remember to send someone to follow up on that later. Anyway, at least he's out of the picture for the time being. You might be happy to know that your efforts haven't gone unnoticed, either. The Brass have been throwing around the idea of having the President visit the dam for a while now, to rally the troops and boost morale and such. With our recent achievements, they finally feel secure enough to stage the damn thing. But while it's being planned, I have one last mission for you. Several years ago, we managed to wrest the Helios-1 solar power station from the Brotherhood of Steel chapter local to this area. It was a crushing victory, but no one's heard a peep from the Brotherhood since. Most people assume the Brotherhood is scattered and not a threat. Recently, we've had scouts go missing in an area west of Helios, and I'm concerned that the Brotherhood is involved. I want you to find them, and once you do, finish them for good. Any questions? No. Just because you secured the aid of the Khans, assuming they don't try to kill us, don't think the Brotherhood will be so easily swayed. These are people that both hate us and outgun us. There can be no compromise. Anything else? A fair question, and one I've had our strategists think about for some time. Their consensus is that we must focus on the one thing we can count on. With the Brotherhood, that's their obsessive attachment to technology. They'd never go anywhere that didn't have working power. I'm willing to bet that wherever they're hiding, there's a working reactor powering their equipment. That's their vulnerability. Detonate that reactor, and we can safely cross the Brotherhood off our list of concerns. Is there anything else? After the battle, we consolidated our hold on the plant before pursuing our enemies. It was a mistake, to be sure, but there wasn't really any place for them to go. When we finally gave chase, however, they had simply vanished. Some of our people think they had some means of conveyance, like the vertebrates the Enclave used and hightailed it out of here. I think that they found some place to hide close to Helios and never went that far at all. Any other questions? As I said, our scouts were some ways west of Helios when they disappeared. Dismissed. I need to talk to you about something, if you have a minute. Any day now? Caesar's going to try to march across Hoover Dam and kick NCR out of the Mojave. We're getting caught up in something important out here. Hell, after how you handled Benny, you're practically right in the middle of all this. I know I'm just along for the ride, but it's made me think about the past, and how I might be able to help out. I wasn't always with the followers, or with the NCR. My late father was an officer in a group called the Enclave, a remnant of America's pre-war government. Memories being short around here, not a whole lot of people remember them. But they did bad things. Terrorized communities, kidnap people. Eventually someone stopped them. I was born a few years later at a military base on the coast, a place called Navarro. A lot of different places. I only know what I was told. Some of them were cut down by the NCR and the Brotherhood. Some of them went east. My mother never told me what happened to my father. But she and I went south with some others and integrated into the NCR. When the NCR learned that Enclave personnel had integrated, we kept moving to the fringes. It's one of the reasons why I wound up out here. After the Enclave's command structure fell apart, it was only a matter of time before Navarro was overrun by NCR forces. My mother and I left with some of the troopers from my father's old unit, the same people I've kept in contact with over the years. Anyone who didn't get out was killed by the NCR. Even some of the ones who escaped were eventually hunted down by the Brotherhood of Steel. The Enclave did a lot of bad things. But there were good people at Navarro. Good people with a lot of experience. Not many of them are alive anymore, but I think they can make a difference in the fight against Caesar. That's a hard question to answer. I know I don't want the Legion to take Hoover Dam. So militarily, yes, I want them to help NCR. If possible, I'd like to figure out a way to help the NCR win Hoover Dam without holding New Vegas. Great. I'd like you to talk to the old-timers, the remnants. I don't think I could convince them by myself. To them, I'm still a kid. But you're a big part of what's happening out here. When you talk to them, they'll understand how important this all is. I've kept in contact with them over the years, so I know where you can find them. But I doubt they'll open up to you unless I come along. I know I'm not always the most serious guy around, but this means a lot to me. 
Thanks. Hello?